Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Just wanted to share briefly um, a little bit about last night. So a little more about last night. So last night, um, there were a couple of us down here. A couple other people showed up, went home, got tents. We had some extra tents. People helped each other set up. Um, and you know, you heard about what happened with the with the police. Um, they said they were going to arrest us. They then they back they back down from that. And so we stayed. But then some really amazing thing happened. We went and slept a little bit, and we kept hearing. For those of us who were out yeah. here last night, you remember this. I don't know. Every once in a while, you'd hear somebody say, "I heard this." young woman's voice outside the tents just very quietly saying I mean it was the middle of the night saying I'm leaving hot tea outside the tent uh, you know early in the morning uh, we hear um, I'm leaving egg and cheese English muffin sandwiches here for breakfast people just started showing up not people we had called not people we had reached out to just people who heard about what was happening here and just started showing up to take care of the people who were camping out here and that's, you know, when Cynthia said, like, we're going to show them who we are, that's who we are. Like, we are people who have been working in this community, in our communities, taking care of each other, building a movement to make this state better and to build a new, a new and better world. And people like Terry, who I'm sure we're going to hear from soon, have been doing this work a long, long time, Kevin and others. And so that's who we are. And we saw just, yeah, we just saw the, the angel side of, of, uh, of Rhode Islanders and our brothers and sisters last night, as well as you know, as well as uh, thinking about the fight that we're up against. So, and, you know, I think that's going to keep happening. And, you know, last night we were, you know, six and take a look around this circle and we'll see where we are tomorrow. Um, but I don't think people are going to stop until we get, uh, until we get the change that we need here, which as Cynthia said, is that we, we make sure that no one freezes to death and that we resolve this homelessness crisis. So back to Cynthia. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.